A developing story in the Bronx right now. A wind turbine collapsed in Co-op City, setting off a frightening series of events. The top of the structure taking out a big billboard in a busy parking lot. CBS 2's Charlie Cooper is following the story live in Co-op City. Charlie. Yeah, a car is smashed. There's pieces of that wind turbine all over the place here by Bartow and Baychester Avenues. Actually, t a billboard, pieces of that wind turbine and a pole came tumbling down around 1.30 this afternoon. Thankfully, no one was hurt. Uh, the Department of Buildings and First Responders are out here trying to work to get the situation under control. Now, what's angering neighbors is that there's been ongoing controversy as far as this pole and this wind turbine goes. Actually, they fought against this um, a, a month and a half ago. It was placed here and they fought against it. They actually got some help from city council members to actually fight this battle. But only weeks later, that wind turbine found its way back up. Uh, the owner actually put it back up just two weeks ago. While you build something this tall in a neighborhood like this, imagine if it would have, whole thing would have fell over. You're talking about crashing into a highway, crashing into buildings. Crashing in the stores. We're fortunate that the car that got crushed, the owner wasn't sitting in his car. That would have been a death right then and there. So if anybody builds anything, there has to be better safety measures, and they got to follow the rules. Council member Andy King, who you just heard from, says city council is working to ensure the poles and the turbine are gone as soon as possible. Mayor Bill de Blasio actually says an investigation into how this incident even happened is underway. Now, if you are in the Bartow and Baychester Avenues area, you do want to stay away because of lots of traffic and many of the roads around here are blocked. In Co-op City, Charlie Cooper, CBS 2 News. All right, Charlie, thanks very much.